You can practice this technique in four steps. Let's take the fingering of the high D to demonstrate this technique. With this fingering, we are going to play a C2 and D3 at the same time. First play the C using the fingering of D. Use the vowel O. Now play the D using the vowel E. Now start playing the C with the vowel O, then go to D with the vowel E, and go back to C with the vowel O. Now we have to combine the O and the E, like O, E. Make sure both notes sound as nice as possible. Do not force the low sound like this. Try to make the low sound as lively as possible. Don't blow more firmly to get a high note, but use your vowels to merge them together. If one of the notes is not working well or is weaker, sing the weak note. Always be aware of the dynamic mark the composer has used. It indicates the amount of air and support you should use. Not every multiphonic can be played in every dynamic.